this vision helps take something abstract into actionable steps. Here are five key steps to triple your success as a business owner. In just four minutes, you're going to learn why strategic planning is costing you more than you think, potentially three times the outcomes that you're actually aiming for. So here are the five key steps that every business owner should be applying when doing strategy. So number one is strategy is not just for large corporations. It actually is for small to mid-sized businesses. A really common misconception is, well, that's only what large corporations do. Well, the reality is I've spent the majority of my career working in companies from startup up to about $100 million in revenue and size. The reality of this is no matter every business, no matter its size, are going to have more success with a written plan. Matter of fact, businesses that have a written plan are 42% more likely to achieve their goals if they're written down. The second thing you want to do is create a three-year vision. Now, this is not just a vision statement. According to Cameron Harold, who is an author of The Division and actually a guest of the show, wrote that a vision should have three years in the future. This involves sending a clear picture. It's not just a vision statement, but you want to talk about what is your clients, what's your market focus, what are your employees like, geography, products you're serving, detailed. This vision helps take something abstract into actionable steps. By the way, hi, my name is Carl J. Cox. I'm the author of Lost at CEO, and for over two decades, I've actually led seven different companies to double their size or more. And today, I help dozens of other companies as a consultant do the same for theirs as well. All right, step number three, use the Pareto principle. Take calculated risk. Focus on the key strategic opportunities that yield the greatest potential impact. See, the Pareto principle focuses on this key area. When you do these 20% of things, you're going to come up with so many different ideas, but the top 20% should have 80% of the impact. So every idea is not a good idea when you're doing strategic planning. Focus on the things that's gonna create the most value and make sure you have the right amount of resources focusing on it so you actually get it done. Don't try to boil the ocean, focus on the most important things. Step number four is define leading indicators, not just the lagging indicators to track your progress. One of the things that we've learned from Amazon is that they are relentless about this. Company retreats, we tend to focus on the end picture. We need to get to a certain amount of revenue or a certain amount of net income or EBITDA. The problem is this, is that's not how you get there. You get there by focusing on the things you can actually control. So focus on the leading indicators and make sure they're actually in your strategic plan. You're gonna have such a better outcome when you focus on this, your destination. Matter of fact, just this alone can get you three times the outcomes just focusing on leading indicators rather than lagging indicators. And finally, number five, incorporate the modern tools that we have today before us. You know, it has been challenging to write a vision or to come up with even sometimes a strategic plan, but we could use tools like ChatGBT to help create this parts to it. You know, when like creating that vivid vision, we can use tools about the company future, guiding strategic decisions and ensuring alignment across the entire organization. We have a tool itself, if you'd like to use it, to help make this process so much faster. Connect with us and you can download the prompt if you like. We'd love to help you out to make sure you get there faster. Finally, every business owner, if they're serious about growth, only has to invest about 2% of their time on strategy to triple your outcomes. Can you believe that? Just 2%. That's about equivalent to 40 hours per year. By the way, that's how we got our name, 40 Strategy. It's because when you focus that 40 hours a year, that is the right amount of focus. And when you do it the right way, you get incredible outcomes. We've seen it time and time again. It's not an accident. So the goal remains the same to ensure that every step you take is intended towards your destination. Subscribe to us on YouTube to learn great strategies to increase the value of your business.